Hi guys and welcome back to Bonaire Arts Education and Training. So today our tip is going to be about arts and crafts. Now one of the things that Bonaire Arts Education and Training focuses on is expression. This is going to be our focus today. It's not a technique per se but it is so important in making sure that you become your own artist. Some of you may be watching today because you found out that you know we help in that specific area of doing your arts and your crafts. No matter what it is, whether you like to make something, whether you like to paint, whether you like to study, um, handwriting, anything like that, it is a form of art. And the focus on expression is about it being solely true to you. The word art sums up everything. It, it, it sums up singing, acting, dancing, anything like that. But when we speak about arts and crafts, we are speaking about painting and drawing and and, and building and all of those things. The scope for art is so wide. There's no real wrong answer. And that's one of the things that I want to tell you. When, you know, you go to school or anything like that, you do get graded in class. But I personally do not agree with that because I believe that art is about expression. I believe it's about what you, how you connect with it. Many people connect through painting and drawings by um, things that they've experienced in the past or it's an inspiration. Some people are inspired by um, Van Gogh or um, Picasso or any of those sort of artists. Monet, you know, I know that I really love Monet's art. And so a lot of my paintings is, is truly inspired by him. But some people create art um, paintings and drawings personal, by personal experiences and there's nothing wrong with expression there's nothing also wrong with someone loving your piece of art and someone not liking it because art is truly about preference and it's about how you express yourself and how another person receives it never get offended if someone doesn't particularly like your art it's natural to do so because it came from a place that you love, but it's that's the whole point of it. It's all about how how we receive it, how how we give it, and it's all about expression as a whole. So I really hope today you've understood how expression is such a big part of about creating your art and making it unique to you. Picasso, Monet, Van Gogh, all these great artists wouldn't be great if they didn't have a specific um, thing that made them unique. It just wouldn't work for them. What's going to make you unique today when you go home and you do your painting and you do your drawing? What makes you unique? Find a place inside you that helps you to express yourself amazingly on that piece of paper or on that canvas or on that wall or wherever you want to <laughs> create. Thank you so much for tuning in today. I really hope that you learned a little something. If you have not subscribed, please do below. Thanks a lot.